Hey guys, Eric Ash, News Boxing. I'm gonna go over what we have on the floor here. We've got them all over the gym. We incorporate this design to use all the different angles in boxing. So, if we get in our stance, we're using a 45 degree stance, traditional boxing stance. So it's pretty simple. When I get in my traditional boxing stance, I step on this 45 degree angle, this front foot's forward, my back foot's at a 45 perpendicular. Now I have a reference point, okay? So I'm gonna teach you guys the 45 degree roll today. So it's here, we're in our stance, and we roll from the inside out as we move our feet and drop our elevation. From here, roll, and when I land, when I go forward at my 45 degree, when I come up from the roll, my hip is square to the square, my back foot is up, pivoting forward. So my hips are square. Pressure's on the outside of my left foot. When I roll back on the 45 degree, it's the opposite. So here, I go from the outside in, roll. Here, now I've got pressure on my back foot. Still riding this 45 degree line. Okay, so you can do this for a full round. You can do it for three rounds. Yesterday we did this for two. We go here, roll, back, roll, back, roll, back. The more you practice this movement, the better you're gonna get, more efficient you're gonna get with your movements. You don't have to make big movements when you do this. You can slightly move your head, boom, back, right? Then you can start incorporating punches. So say if I'm going for my jab, I feel my jab, jab, roll, back, right hand, back, roll, hook, back. So really, when we're moving, we want to create distance when we go to our right. And we want to take away distance when we go forward. Okay, so here, I roll forward, hook, roll back, right hand, to keep the distance so I can fully extend my punch and, and connect right at the end, okay? So sit, that's one movement that we use for this diagram, okay? We can use different, different. Uh, we can use these, these marks here, the 90 degree marks, just for doing our footwork drills. So I can go forward, forward, back, just go into the different quadrants. Okay? And then also, of course, we can use it when we go around and use these little pie slices. Ready? So here, step, 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 step. Working on keeping our hips back and our shoulders back. So, you guys can easily incorporate this at your house. Put this in your garage or on your driveway, and then you can work your footwork movements, okay? If you guys have any questions, please feel free to uh, contact us, and please give us a like on YouTube. Thank you.